when I was a player, going to going to Bramwell Lane and playing there was enough motivation I needed for anything. Uh, it's a fantastic place to uh, to to go and uh, play. The atmosphere, if the, weather, if the weather's nice, that'll add to it. Uh, the atmosphere will be fantastic. Um, as a player, it's a game you should be thoroughly looking forward to. Um, message to the players will be will be that obviously if you don't turn up, you'll get turned over because obviously they're um, they're a really really good team. Uh, no different to what we say to them normally. Um, we've got to enjoy that pressure. Um, got to start realizing you have to play with pressure because it's a pressured environment. Um, and yeah, the, the, at the end of the day, we, we want to win the game of football and we'll go there and I'll pick the team that I think will be best suited for that game. And uh, yeah, hopefully we can help the teams around them um, and beat them and obviously uh, stop them on their way to possibly getting in the playoffs. It's going to be a tough game. They're obviously a good team. Um, doing really well in the league. They're pushing for the playoffs and they So they're going to be really up for it and we've just got to match that and then hopefully we can get a result. I said, we've got to stop worrying about everyone else. We've just got to concentrate on ourselves and what we're going to do and how we're going to do it um, in the way we we think is the best way we can. And uh, um, we're not going to, definitely not going to sit here and put pictures up of the wall of, oh, look at what Luton can do. Oh, look at what this team can do. Oh, look at what Sheffield United can do. We're going to fully, so, uh, uh, wholly focus on ourselves and what we think is the best plan going forward uh, with the group of players we've got, um, whether that's this season or next season. Um, and uh, yeah, hopefully that will be uh, that will be all we need. Yeah, I'm really enjoying it. Obviously, it's great to to be playing. And obviously, I don't mind where anywhere anywhere will do for me as long as I'm playing left. But um, yeah, I think it's really good to learn different positions and get a better understanding of the game and where to, where to pass the balls if you're in a different position and stuff. So yes, yeah, it's, it's good. Pressure now becomes delivery. Um, obviously, we've still got four games to go. Obviously, we want to get as many positive results as we can, but Ultimately, the big, the big, the big job now is to give in the is giving the fans and the football club a team that they can be really, really proud of under my uh, under my watch next season. And um, uh, it's something we will work hard uh, over the summer doing. We're working hard doing it now. Uh, but obviously, once the transfer window opens, I think it's June the first or whatever it might be, um, we'll be working incredibly hard. We'll We'll, we will have our holidays, but they won't be my holiday. Won't be holidays like it was previously. I'll be I'll be working um, uh, as hard as I can to make sure that that when we come back on the twenty second of June, that um, as many of those bodies are in as I can, um, and then in the short pre season, which is only five weeks this year, um, we start nailing everything down player wise. Um, culture-wise, and um, we're ready to go come 30th of July. Uh, every game we want to win and, and get the most amount of points we can, but also on the other hand, we want to we want to be prepared and be ready for next season. So it's about getting those results, but doing it in a way where we can, we can put ourselves in good stead for next season. So.